proud to unveil the first chapter of Travify's new CRM experience, built from the ground up to simplify your workflow and streamline how you manage your entire business inside a single platform. So this launch includes some really exciting areas. Firstly, invoices. Invoices will help you send professional branded invoices tied directly to trips. No more manual data entry. You can auto fill an invoice from an itinerary in one click, set payment schedules and collect PCI compliant credit card authorizations and track all of it in Travify. Contacts, we've relaunched and completely revamped con the contacts experience to make it easier to organize client data like birthdays, loyalty numbers, passports, and preferences with custom fields and a clean new user interface. Next, commissions. Say goodbye to spreadsheets and jumping between different systems. Now and very, very soon, you'll track and manage commissions that are linked to trips and clients, and you can auto-populate commissions in a single click from an invoice. Also, email. We've seen this as a huge need um, for, for a while, and we're excited that now you can connect your existing branded email address. So everything you send from Travify can come from your own business email address, which will improve email deliverability. And even better, you can view all of your client email communication directly in the client pro profile. This will be available for Gmail, Outlook, and IMAP, which will cover and support virtually any email provider out there. Now, these are some incredible releases that have been long awaited by many of you, but this isn't just an upgrade. It's really a connected system that saves time, reduces human error, and helps you deliver a more professional experience without needing five different tools in the process. And we think you'll really see that during the product demo when Stephanie and Liart take you through that. So these releases represent thousands of hours our team's been working on um, over the past few months, and we're really investing back in our product for you. What's even more exciting about all of this is we're not done yet. These are huge releases that we're showing you today, but they're just the beginning. These releases serve as the foundation of future tools we'll be building for better client management, automation, reporting, and connecting your data back to your agency or your host. So while we couldn't be more excited about these releases, we're even more excited about the enhancements we have that are in the works and will continue to improve and build the CRM for you. Okay, so let me uh, share my screen so we can get in here, but I'm, I'm very thrilled to be the one to to get to walk you through uh, invoicing commissions and email integration today. So let's go into demo mode here. Let's pretend that my client, Susie, Susie Smith, is booking a trip with me with hotels, tours, and transfers. So we've already finalized the trip details. So you can see, here's my trip right here. She already has her um, all of her information, her itinerary, but now it's time to send her the invoice. So let's build that really quick together. And you're gonna see just how simple and easy this is. So let's start off by adding this invoice. So. What you're going to do, if this is the first time you've seen this, you're just going to go ahead and keep everything in this one trip. So talk about organization. It's amazing. So we're just going to go ahead and add this invoice. Now, another really amazing tool built in here is that you can actually auto pull um, line items or like the tours, the transfers, whatever it might be directly from the itinerary. So they're working together. So how you would do this is I can drop down right here from the select itinerary mode. And I can just go ahead and say the itinerary and then just auto populate it from here. Look at this. Look at everything populate automatically. This on its own is incredible. But what's also really great is that you are able to go in and you can manually edit any of this. So if you need to add description, change that, we can always add another item here and just say like, if we wanted to put in like the final deposit, um, we could put that in here. And I'm just gonna go ahead and um, I could add, let's just say, 2000, and then we can also increase that. And you'll notice as I'm doing this, that the total amount displays down here. So that's one thing that's really nice is it's, it's auto calculating all of this for you. Now, next up, the other great thing that you can do here is you're also able to add different installments, so different payments. So if you want to use a payment schedule, you can do that. You just go ahead and right down here, just check that box of use payment schedule. Um, we can add an installment. So we could say, you know, this is um, the first deposit and then maybe this is final deposit. Um, and you can add all that here. That 
Now let's preview it. And there you'll see if you did display line by line, that's how it would look. So in this one, you can see this is one that got sent to a client already and they've already started making payments. So what's nice about this is that they have this one view that they can always come back to and see when is my next payment? So the next payment due is 7,000. Or I can, they can also say like, well, it's not due yet, but I'm gonna go ahead and give you a thousand just to get that out of the way now. They could do that as well. But what's great is then you're also able to come in and you can view when things are paid. Um, and something else that's really nice, um, we added this shortly after releasing this a couple months ago, where you also can just go ahead and mark things as paid. So if, you know, um, Susie comes into my office with a $7,000 check, which is a very large check, um, then I might be like, perfect, that's great. I, let me just go ahead and mark this as paid. So if you've been using invoicing before, you might notice this money symbol here. Hmm, what is that? Well, drum roll, this is where commissions comes in. So this is one of the things I know everyone's like, yes, let's go. So in here, we now have the commissions. Now this is coming soon. We'll talk about more timeline here in just a bit, but I have a little access here so I can show you a sneak peek. But basically what you're able to do now is on these invoices, or you can add it manually, which I'll show you, you can custom add commission tracking. You're able to say, okay, for this hotel reservation, let me go ahead and track in all the information for my commission as well. So I can add all this information in here. Um, and then what you'll be able to do is you can see all of your commissions in here. So I'm going to open my commission. Here's where now my business, I can see what I'm making, what is still due. I can keep track of everything in here for my commissions. So you'll see right here, this top one was that uh, commission that I put in. So you can put, um, you know, the, the, the commission split, all of that good stuff in here. Um, and then you also can add when is it actually received. You saw me do this from an invoice, but you also could come in here and actually just say new commission and create one in here as well. Um, so you can add them manually in here too. So it's really easy. So not only is it helping you stay organized, but now you know, um, you know what you're owed and when money can literally get left on the table, like thousands of dollars. And this is going to help them get paid. This is already, okay. So this is already so exciting with invoicing or the invoices and commissions. I'm not even done yet because something you've heard us talk about is how to keep all the client communication connected. So enough about, you know, getting paid, very important, but it's also important to just have a great experience for your clients and stay connected. And now you can easily keep your emails viewable in your Travify account with email integration. Now, where you're going to find email integration at right now is you're going to find it in your con in the contacts. So in your client profile. So remember earlier, my pretend client here is Susie Smith. So you can see as I open her contact profile, here's the new thing. If your eye is seeing it, that email all the way on the far right, you see that? Now I can connect my email account. Now, again, right now is only Gmail and we'll have more coming very soon. Um, but I want to show you how easy it is to set up that I decide I just remove my account and I'm just going to do it right now in front of everybody so you can see how easy this is. So let's get our email in here. There's account here and sign in. And then you're just going to go ahead and select um, that Travify can access this. Click continue, done. Would that take a few seconds? And here's the best part. Notice how my inbox just filled up. It is automatically going to recognize the email associated with this contact and pull in all of your correspondence in there. So it'll have all your past email threads in here. So I can come in, I can look at everything, um, I can, you know, compose new messages, but I can see everything that's been talked about in here. And I can also reply back. So I could go ahead and I'm just going to drop in my email here. This is my email response. And you can do things like add links. You can do all that formatting in there as well. And then just click reply. 
and done. I don't have to leave Travify now to go set up and send that email. I can send it right in here. Um, so you'll never lose a thread. You'll never forget what they talked about um, and all that good stuff. But one thing that's really nice too is this is coming from my email, which is going to help with deliverability. So that is another thing that is just really big and very exciting about this as well.